So, starting to tear apart the kitchen. I have this wall out so that my mudroom is going to be walking when you get in the door of a little entry there into the mudroom. This wall, that ceiling, and this stuff's all coming down. I shouldn't say the wall, I should say the wood. Wood's coming down, the ceiling's coming down. Resheet rock this whole thing. I'm not sure what to do about the shelves or the sink. I might just leave it. Or this here. Oh, we'll see. And this is going to be a door. A door to the bathroom. Which someday will be under the stairs that lead up here. We'll get there. So the ceiling's out. Didn't take long at all. And big surprise, there's another ceiling under there. Um, so I'm pretty sure the ceiling is going to come out. Uh, it does kind of look neat. It has a very rustic feel to it, but I'd have to repaint it. But other than that, um, the other thing I was thinking about was really what I want to do. I could actually put my laundry down here. Where the stove is, I could actually put my laundry here. I'd have the laundry chute right there. And I have a sink right here. I'm actually toying with the idea, but I'm not too sure yet. Well, we're tearing out some more boards here. I'm tearing out the boards, the, all the yellow boards on that wall, and this wall here. And so all these things are coming out. I'll end up sheetrocking this here. End up looking in the walls and I'm finding these little glass pieces here. I found something in here and then I'm looking over here. What I'm finding looks like this old, this really old it's like a coin purse or some kind of a a wallet. Ralph E something. Can't tell what that says. I'll have to look at it closer later. Kind of old billfold or something. Of course, when you find a wallet, there's never any money in it. This one's kind of really just old, old. Really cool though, I'll have to go through it more later and see what that writing says. It's uh, definitely old. We'll see what else I dig up in the walls. I'm in the process of uh, tearing out the ceiling. And it looks like a bomb went off. It really looks like a disaster area. Oh, it kind of is. It's kind of funny walking through this. It's almost like this house has fallen in on itself. When in fact, I did this on purpose. But I'm only about halfway done, so uh, we will see when I get a little bit further. It's coming along. Happy April Fool's Day. Yeah. This is my mudroom. Soon to be. Although it looks like a disaster at the moment. This is how I like to do my projects. I make a big mess. And then I'll clean it up. But I got one more wall to take out. Correction, two more walls to take out in a little bit. And know what's left of the ceiling. Got a trailer coming from the neighbor. He's going to drop it off in a bit. And I'll haul all this wood out of here. I hope.
Chimney removal. It's gone now. One upstairs too. Took the whole thing out. This wall is now out. Ceiling's out. Uh, I found this out of the ceiling. It uh, it's stuck. The string stuck in between the floorboards and the beam. I don't know how it got there, but there. Neat yo-yo. And uh, take a look at this room before I get to getting the wiring in and the sheetrock. Get it uh, insulated too. Not sure what to do about this wall yet. No, I'm getting there. <laughs>